Hello, welcome back to Bad Debts. We're here at Seeing Square. Uh, we've just explored most of the streets up here. There was a sorcerer's tomb we couldn't find a way in. There was a locked door here we needed a key for. Uh, there's also a place up here that we need a key for that I didn't mark down, so I should do that now. Let's put it up here. Key. Uh, and we got all the way around here to see the user's house uh, and the canal. I didn't jump in the canal, but um, that's probably an option. But for now, the plan is go explore this part of the streets, then head around here back to where our objective is. So let's do that. Ways to climb, always nice. Okay, get, get up there. I don't need a mantle onto that, can I? Probably not. Nope. Nope. All right, I'll just find another way to get up higher. No, uh, that's going south. Yeah, we want to go south and west. Who's this I hear? Anyway, that's who it was. Oh dear, what is this place? Where are we? What is all this new streets? I haven't even really looked at the map. I guess we're near the Hammerite Seminary. <laughs> uh, and a carrot dies to a ladder again. He really ought to know better at his age. Let's uh, attempt that again. Uh, you didn't see me. Alright, um, okay. Hmm. Son of a I'm just waiting for him to get out of uh, around the corner. Should have heard that, if anything. All right. Roughly, what to say? Department of Public Works, Downlock Ward Division, Fate to Tarsus Two Subjunction. Warning: Dangerous conditions. Do not throb. High voltage. Well, it won't let me throb. So otherwise, you know I was gonna. There's a ledge on there we might be able to jump to. Wait, is that the same ledge we saw before? Is this a big castle? But I don't think that's a big. That's not the same big castle bit we've been to, is it? I don't know, everything looks the same. There's no point trying to get across there. So what are we doing here if not trying to jump across to the public works? It's a really good question. I don't know if we can get back down, but... Well, I don't know if we can get up there. I can't go up there. <laughs> It's definitely not the same place I've been. We go around this way. More cars, which way am I looking? East. I don't think we get out the territory we've been to, but I don't know for sure. Explodey barrel. Dear! Unfortunately, it didn't heal me at all. Alright. What's that? Another 10 broadheads, okay. Just a light switch for burn. What can I do with an explodey barrel that I can pick up? That's a really interesting question. Uh, throw it at something and make it go boom. But anyway, let's just check this ledge. It's a ledge. Gotta be a reason for it. Like so. Where are we breaking into here? Archery practice. Oh no, it's just a dart. Oh, it's a weapon vendor, isn't it? Hmm. I don't know. 
what's marked? Anything marked? Not sure. Maybe like those, but maybe not then again, maybe not. Let's try a rope. Physics. Yikes. Uh, Shrek, uh, not not gas. Root. Try a combination of those things. Firstly, rub it at an angle. Secondly, let's see if we can just drop down. Oh. Ouch. Well, whatever. I was gonna say drop down and catch it on the way down, but uh, I guess this works. Noisy floor. I think I can hear someone sleeping. Should prepare a flash bomb. Just in case I'm going to need one. So this is up. Super noisy floor, and I've only got two more arrows, and I'd rather keep them for the actual objective if I need to. That's right, Cat is patient if he is nothing else. He wants to tap dance, but uh, he doesn't need to tap dance tonight in particular. Sitting in his chair. Stone floor next to them, thankfully. This tends to go terribly wrong. It tends to be that like, I try to knock them out and they end up getting bed instead. <coughs> Alright, got it. And the bed goes clang. Ah, oh, darts, anyway. Other rule, guard practices is archery. Uh, not quite dead centre, but you know, whatever. Where's that? I hope it's disappeared, whatever it was. Oops. Come back here, looty thing. What, is, what are you? Oh, it's a shirt, alright. It's neatly folded, it doesn't come unfolded when I throw it around. This way. Is there anything hiding behind these barrels? But no, I can't move them. Uh, let's finish robbing the shop before I explore that way. Oh, we can't loot that candle, even though it looks gold. Yeah, you have guards in your bloody uniforms. I see. Jeez! I want it and cucumbers! Whoa, that's a whole wheel cheese. Doesn't heal me any more than anything. Ah, uh, no healing. Alright, let's check that sink. Plates aren't worth anything. Anything in the fireplace? Nope. Oh, there's another door. Well, apparently, I can't unlock it. It's not making any sound. Moss arrow. 
Heroes, Brothers. Ah, this is lovely loot. No money, but uh, equipment's good. thieves out there, huh? Hmm. Not really ideal. Especially when I uh, fumble for the keys. Because <laughs> yeah, I've uh, had my hand over the F6 and F7 for the uh, lockpicks. And then I tried to move away, I pressed the tried to back up and went sideways instead, and then when I tried to run away. Uh, oh no, oh, what? I'm gonna Oh yeah, that's not gonna work. Better than that. Uh where's my escape route? Nope. Get on the rope, on the rope. Oh, out of the way. No, on the rope. You've made enemies, Taffer. Count your hours. You know what? I've made enemies, you've made enemies. We're all enemies here. What's this? Guards! Over here! Haha! Fun gutting you, Tapper Boy. Closing in, Tapper. I hope that does attract the guards, you know, because you guys are thieves and I've seen an intruder. Look sharp. Oh, I didn't kill you. You know you can't hide forever. Did I tell you? As soon as I find you. There's a guard. Wait, you're not attacking the I thieves. Saw someone in here a bit ago. Look, there's a thief right in front of you. Don't tell me you're working with them. I'm gonna count to three. Oops. Broken in. Looks real you better mean. just keep watching your back. Yeah. All right. Uh, well. Oh, well, that doesn't really work. Alright, I'm guessing opening that door is not a good idea for me. So, I'm just gonna kill this banner. I'm gonna go ahead and look at what's up these other stairs. Not this way. And then I'm gonna go back up my rope. There's a door there. I keep going up. And another door and uh, some rafters. Do you think there's anything on those rafters? Do you think I feel a compulsion to check? Why do you know? Not just one, two bits of loot. All right, 750. We're uh, getting, doing pretty well on that quick goal. The last time we picked a lock, it was uh, hazards for our health. We can't seem to pick this one. Seems to be a lot of locks and very few keys. This one. All right. Uh, I don't really know where we are. This Tomlinson's. Maybe. It's roughly the right place. No, it's not. It's up here. I don't know. Just put it here. More keys needed. I don't know whether these doors actually have keys in the level or whether they're just there for. Uh, look like they're interesting doors. Alright, back to the shop front. And uh, one last task before... Yeah, Gary, your aim is terrible. And 
wonder those guys are killing you. Alright. Back up to the rafters if I can. Seems I can. Good. And then back. Out we go. Yeah, there's just looks for lights. Alrighty. I've kind of forgotten where we're going. We had an exploded barrel. And does this explode if I uh, just throw it on the street? It does, alright. Experiment uh, concluded. Drop it on those two uh, nasty taffers who are waiting to <laughs> cut my face off. I can hear them, you know. Walking back and forth down there somewhere. Can I take it down the street level with me? Safely? This is not a good question. I can't even remember how I got up here now. Oh, I jumped from there. Oh no, how am I gonna, gonna get back? Can't jump around the corner. Uh. Can't get down there, can I? Not safely. This didn't have a way down. Uh, I guess we're going back into the shop then. I guess we're going to have to pick that lock on the door because I don't see any other way down. Uh, I don't have a slow fall potion, I've got a speed potion, but not a slow fall. Otherwise I could just jump around. I could kill this guy, but he doesn't really bother me. Well, guess what we're doing? We're balancing barrels of explosive precariously on the rafters. Saving again. Try now awkward Rivera thing. Picking it up. Let's just save here. Uh, actually, I'll put it down first. Let's just save here. And then. Alright, made it that time. That was what I wanted to do the first time. Now, alright, so. May be able to use this to stop them uh, pathfinding. Actually, I may stop them getting through there. And that should stop the door from opening. <laughs> All right. Can I pick a lock from here? No, I'm just too far away. Do this. I don't know what my plan is beyond maybe climb the rope now that I'm prepared for them. Guess that's it. Guess that's my plan. It's not much of a plan. coming now. This time. Or is it just not coming yet? Are they just patrolling out there? So why did he walk in to me the moment I unlocked the door the other time? So Bizarre, all right. Let's try to have some fun. Oh, I don't have any fire arrows. 
Broadheads aren't gonna break that break it, are they? Nah. Mm. Hey! Who's the creep? Ugh. Good question. We can wait, Tapper! We can wait! Yeah. Hey, what's this? It's called a banner. You better hope I find you before the guards do. Yeah, what are you gonna do if you do? Why don't you go back to the doorway there? Well, there's a nice noise to attract your attention. No? This is, this is getting silly. Oh, it's getting very silly. Uh, what do I do with them? I can black, I can flash bomb them, right? You guys could just walk through the closed door and the barrel like that. Damn you! Everyone, this way! Everyone? Oh, uh, yeah. Well, I guess it's gonna be a while before they all come down. But while I'm here, let's see where this leads. So I don't have any other way out. All right, we're at a well. We're in a courtyard. Uh, which way am I facing? Facing east. Yeah, it must be must be around here somewhere. That looks like a passage down there. All right, this is a. Uh, I can't climb vines, can I? Oh, I can climb vines. Guard friend going back. Doesn't sound like he has any uh, help with them. He's a uh, pretty uh, tough vines here. Is this the weaponsmiths? Uh, the Wainwright. Chest. The Book of Smash. Mm. You know, whenever you find like interesting semi magical places like this. Oh, armor key. Is that that one? Alright, so that's the top floor. Should I read the Book of Smash? You know, it's probably going to bring something horrible here. Let's read it. What's it going to do? Book of Smesh, being an inquiry into the mysteries of the Lady of the Woods and the Arts of the Honeymaker Beast by Algernon M. Tomlinson, the Advocate. Fills you the decanter with glee, fills you the merry cup with dreams, fills you the memories with mirth, fills you the glades with sing, fills ravening gallants with the fleshes and bloods of takers and hammerers, forgets the beams and forgets the toils, forgets the roofs and forgets the rules, forgets the who's and forgets the no's, forgets the wives and forgets the two old childs. Shouts the pleasures of the ladies and shouts the wisdoms of the honey maker beasts, dancers and takers and frolics and sings, cavorts in shouty fever with beastesses and greensy trees. Alright, 
is a pagan place rather than a uh, necromancer sort of place. I've uh, ever since in uh, the Thief 2's Life of the Party or the demo equivalent, the necromancer spy reading the Book of Ash there has left me nervous of places with skulls and braziers and strangely labelled books. <laughs> I imagine that uh, guard has given up by now, but even if he has not, I'm gonna try and get back on the vines. <laughs> Bad idea. I think I'm gonna go down the door. Go down the stairs. What if over here if he's given up? He'll not be yelling around. Darksy streets. Back up here because it's the second flat in the same building that we couldn't get into before. <laughs> that was locked. Wait, where's the Amrit's key now? Right, is it the same key? It is indeed. It's been his house, I guess, not just his shop. Second copy of it. Another unreadable book. Ah, oh, it's just the stairs, alright, that's all there is. Odd. I guess the idea is... That's it. Well, because it didn't come from this side. It's kind of pointless to me. <laughs> but, uh, if I had... He's there admiring the uh, the view, I guess. Alright, which way am I going now? Probably still want to continue southwest. Alright, I got those keys. So, do you have a minute? Several minutes for you to sleep. Oh wait, now we're going north. Uh, are we back at the intersection we started at? Uh, well, I've definitely been here because I climbed up there, and that's in fact how I got to where we were just in the armors there. And. Vaguely familiar? No. Oh dear, I'm lost again. Oh yeah, I was up there before I came down here. Alright. Oh god, I'm so lost. I'm kind of south and east. So we came... We didn't quite come this way because we got distracted. We could have come this way. Tomlinson's finds arms... Fine arms and armors. Or oh, whatever. Blah. Alright, I could get on his roof. I don't think I'm going to. Because I don't think there's going to be anything up there. So now if we keep going... Oh wait, I want to go that way. I want to go that way. Right, now I know where we are. Heading west. Wait, so have I been down here? 
Well, I mean, I know I'm going to have to go here any further. Nice little dark corner. Hello there. God, I'm looking at TT at uh, someone's place. Actually, you know what? Look at torches. Oh, that didn't much good. There's a room up there. Don't think that's a wooden beam, is it? No, it's brick. It's an odd kind of construction for brick. Yeah, normally you need some kind of support for bricks. Ah, you're not even guarding anything. You just sleep there. All right. South and west. Let's keep going west for the moment, see if it joins up to where we started. Oh, that's weird. And all this uh, places to go, things to do. No, it's good, I, lo I love the exploration, but uh, it's also... Dangerous, especially when I'm on as low health as I am right now. Like, ah! let's see, dangerous. Maybe I won't go up there. Maybe if I get a few more health potions, I might go up there. Yeah, offering to the saint, Saint Garrett. Now this is all looking familiar. Surely I've been all this way before. Northwest. Yeah. Alright, so that's, that's where it branched off. Alrighty. So there's a place up there to go, but I don't know if there's anything to do there. And I don't, certainly don't see a way down from up there. Wait, that's not wood, is it? That's definitely stone. Uh, for, I don't see a way from that height to get down to where I'm now without taking damage, unless you drop onto the lamp post. Oh, it's come on, it's worth a try. One more try. Garrett's died enough times already today, he can afford to take a risk of dying a little more. Alright, let's get those one minute breaks. Try not to break them. So, one option should just go around there. Let's try and get around that ledge, which is too narrow. Let's the other option is to try and get around here. Which he can do. Which then gets around here. Fat load of good that is. Got another lovely little alcove here for Garrett to while away his time. That's too high to get to, that's too steep to climb. Oh, well, this ledge continues. I see. And there's a gargoyle. I'll be making another save in a different spot in case this is uh, deadly. Quickly load the quick save. Uh, before I hop back, because if I can't get down without hurting myself, it'll just be really awkward place to get stuck. Alright. Continue on from here, but I have a backup plan now in case I can't get find my way back down without death! Garrett, shouldn't be that clumsy. Look at that, a shutter that's open. I wonder if there's a way in there. Where does this go? Does this take me to hammer it or anything fun? I don't know. Before I go further, can I make that jump? Ooh, looks tempting, but doesn't look po really possible. What about these? Uh, will the rope arrow stick in there? It will. Then what are you going to do? You're not going to be able to get it back. And you know, this is a thing you can do. A ridiculous thing you can do. Shh, thought it just before we hit the ground. Um, 
That's the repair. That's the one that's not a repair. Look out, look in the window, and there's nothing there. And then take your repair back. <laughs> yeah, no. No, silly. Idea. Oh, God. Make, gotta make this jump again. Alright. That jump. I don't think it's possible to do that jump. I'll try it. One more try. Nah. Alright. So much for carrots. Oh, although. You know. You know. What do we find in the armourers? Ha ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha! And apples! Yay, got some health back! That's totally worth wasting a speed potion for. Uh, I mean, not really, but hopefully, well, there's another way out. Okay. Um, and there's a door up here. Great. So I could have just got in here anyway. I didn't need to waste my speed potion, but never mind. I generally don't use speed potions anyway. I just keep some knives in the rafters. Uh, what have we got? Oh, very, very long ladder. I don't tend to use speed potions much anyway, so, you know, that was fun. Uh, also very risky, which is probably half of why it's fun. Coal cellar. Of where? It's a lovely coal cellar though, very well made. Nice work. There's a door. There's a passage that goes deeper. And some boxes. I wonder if there's anything hiding behind the boxes. Like any kind of gold or anything here. No, just someone tidying away their boxes. Very nice. This door doesn't open. Okay. What happens if we go deeper? And deeper still. It's feeling very sewery. All very damp and mossy walls. Very odd noise there. Oh, cabins. Well, they're not on the map at all. They go further south. So where did we even come in here? Where? I don't know. We're not in the Hammer Knight Seminary yet, but we're around here somewhere. So underneath this area, I guess. Uh, I'm going to check out the other direction first. How's this machinery I was hearing? Oh, is this this, this uh, public works with no entry to it? I mean, does that mean there's no exit as well? Something that's someone there. Or something. Someone. Thiefy man's. Hmm. Or is the sound breaking up? It's stopping. <coughs> you know what? I got some more moss arrows. This is a good place for one. See, he's got a sharp sword. I don't have a body that can really resist sharp swords for long. <coughs> well, there's my speed potion back. I won't say no to that. Oh, we've got Navigator's Compass. Letter. 
Mifflins, I've been thinking. As good as the cellar we are now, using the stash our incoming baggage looked when we set up shop, it seems less and less ideal. Yeah, it's technically two way with exits to down lock and beggars take, but there are some real nasty possibilities around. There's the Hammer Seminary right across the square, and it's positively crawling with heavily armed nutbags. If something bad comes down, our advantage is nil. If we fled, we'd just run into major nutbag territory. Look, I know you think I worry too much, but yesterday there was something which could have sent both of us to Crags Cleft. I was taking a cup full of silk bales to the cellar on behalf of Molly the Spinner. Pays decent, I have your cut in the bag that comes with the message. I'm cursing the bumps on the street before Marcus, when a hammerite spotted me and came over. He praised me for my industry and went on preaching sanctimoniously about the builder's virtues and progress while my belly was travelling up and down. What's worse, he also offered the aid of a few young initiates to carry the bales up and down the stairs. It's a good thing he accepted my word about not refusing my toils, which of course shows how downright gullible and out of touch these fellows could be. But what if he persevered and saw all that gold from the chapel spread on the table? No, I say, we've overstayed our welcome. Let's quietly move house to Shale Bridge where no one asks inane questions. Maybe we could also see what's the deal about the old quarter. There's sure to be got to be something interesting around those parts. Grover. P.S. I'm away for the next few days, paying our friend Frido and his girls a visit. You should also come next time. There's nothing like the baths to take the grime of the city out of you. Better take my offer before the mould down there gets you. Well, if it's not the mould, it'll be the thief. Alright, he's got loot. He's got a thieves key. Okay, I wonder what that opens. Nice new place. Time for a nice new journal too. All in the Mifflin's tradition. Book, quill and ink donated by the upstanding citizens of the city, as previously. Grover doesn't like the idea, but then he's not the guy working as a janitor with a bunch of time to kill when he's not the job. My place, my rules, my risk. Grover says it's his risk too, which is right, I guess, but who would bother a nasty old coal cellar somewhere in Downlock? Rich guy keeps a bunch of empty bottles on a shelf upstairs, but that's it. Nobody likes the coal, the noise, and least of all the creepy noises from the well in the cavern. I don't know, but that isn't barrack work, and I don't like it much either. Still, as long as it keeps to itself, so much for the better. Of course, it was Timsey's tip. For such an unassuming little guy, he sure breaks his nose in much, and knows all the best places in the city to visit. Could be pretty loaded by now from the cuts he has taken, if it wasn't for his helpful pals at the Overlord's Fancy. Last I heard, Garrett was pissed at him for one reason or another, and refused to pay him the agreed upon amount for a job not delivering. What's his problem anyway? Seems like a completely stuck up creep. Doesn't get out, doesn't fraternize, just sulks and doesn't pay his friends as a professional should. And well, his loss and our gain. The warehouse was sure not bad. Grover had to copy a clobber a guy with a pig sticker, but that's part of the job. We gave Timsy one of the fancy shawls as a sign of our appreciation. Sure hope I never end up with him on the other side. He's fast like greased lightning when he's got steel in his hands. This is strange. Tomlinson hired new muscle to watch his front nasty blokes from the downwind as both of them. What's he keeping them for? All the local professionals buy the shop. Plus there are already three heavily armed guards on the property day and night. I swear they never leave their posts unless it's to follow him someplace. Oh well, only a complete idiot would try to hit Tommy now that so many of the old guard are leaving the scene and going legit to sell electrical stuff and whatnot. Reliable merchants are growing scarce nowadays. What are we left with? Farkas and Toller, and that's what. Another night on the job. I didn't even think the lower locks could yield such fat pickings, and in a hammer chapel to boot. Hammers are just nasty customers, but here, it was just one decrepit old guy who went down after one solid whack of the mighty cudgel. We just had to sweep the altar for the gold candlesticks and whatnot, and then there was even time to bring back a nice little extra for old Mifflins. I'm sure none of the other folks have something like this, except maybe the wardens if they took the fancy. But Webster would also never have the appreciation of so fine things. I always thought something wasn't right with that guy. Now we just need some time for the buzz to die down and sell the lot to Marcus or Cutty. Whoever pays more for it. That nosy guy from the department was here again, demanding to see the coal cellar to inspect the boxes. I see a rat when I see one. And this one was stinking from the tail to the nose. So I said they were all operational and that there was nothing seen here anyways. But he wouldn't relent and raise a pretty fuss over it too. Telling he'd go to Master Wilkes, go to his department, go to the watch. And I wonder why he didn't say he'd go to the Master Builder, because I was sure expecting it by this point. But something's got to be done now, for even if Wilkes is nothing to worry about, somebody else could be. So better to fix this problem once and for all. And I'm not talking about the silvers he gave me neither. If he likes them underground holes, he can have them. Well, 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 so nosy guy went down the hole, which is for the best, because now hopefully whatever stuff lives down there doesn't come up, and we don't drink that water anyway. Good job, Mifflin's old chap. Onwards to better things. Oh, well. 
Uh, he's got a nice fancy bed uh, for a dingy place like this and a pretty uh, swanky table there. Uh, not sure why he carted all that stuff off. Uh, he's got a cream man's head mounted on the wall. Alright. So this is just dead end, right? Just just his little uh, corner. All right, nothing up, nothing up there. So how do they get in and out? Because he said something about there being two ways in and out. One leads back to the hammer territory, which I'm guessing is the way I came in. I'm all turned about now. Uh, but I don't think there's any other way to go, is there? Where's right, caverns? Check them out in a minute. Because uh, I've got a key, and I can't remember if the door up here was locked or just wasn't a proper door. Oh! Oh. Just a light switch. Doesn't open the door, no. It's apparently not a door. Uh, which means the way back is... Here among the coal somewhere, and I can't even remember now. where now. Ah, oh, here it is. Alright, well let me... Uh... Yeah, look around, reposition myself on this chair. And inspect the boxes. Is there anything of worth above around the boxes? I didn't actually check, did I? Bottles, bottles, bottles. No. I did actually come in here and look, but there didn't seem to be anything. I'm just taking another look. Boxes are all inspected, none of them broke. Uh, well, it's, for some reason I thought I saw a switch. It wasn't, it was just a bit of texture. Alright, I guess it's to the caverns then, and um, the nasty beast lives down here. Probably a crate man, right? Feels like crate man territory. A hole, all right. It does have a wooden beam, so there's a way back out. So I reckon, gotta, gotta give it a go. Nice, pretty nice caverns as well. Keep an ear open. There's a flame with skulls. Not promising. Oh, he doesn't have any loot on him. Hmm. I wonder what is it lives down here. It's like, as far as I know, Crayman don't tend to collect skulls and line them up in front of flames, but, you know. I'm no expert. Can't hear anything. I'm expecting another trip, basically. I'm not gonna fire arrow for all the good it's gonna do me. We have a diamond. Oh, there's a door. And a rope arrow. Broken arrow. Door does not, doesn't open. Alright, just a creepy place then. Well, I don't teach me to expect uh, tricks, but you know. <laughs> they've already been established in this level as sometimes tricks for the unwary. Well, got some loot. Back to the coal cellar. Found, find our way back up top, and then probably the hammers, I guess. They're probably next on the path, but you know, I can never really predict where I'm going, where the twisty passages will take me. So, I guess I'll just have to find out. Dear, oh dear, it's a long, a long ladder. Ah, let me 
need to get out there. Alright, I don't remember where I am now. Where was this? That's right, I came in the window with my uh, speedy potion of speed. I'm going to get out this window and hope it gets fixed somewhere good. It takes a tunnel. Great, so I did the jump across there. All for no reason, I could have just walked across here and hopped onto this spot. Alrighty, good to know. But, this leaves me with a problem. How do I get down? Uh, not here. Oh, it's a problem we already had, right? That's why I had that extra backup save. So let's jump back across. And let's see about getting down from somewhere here. I mentioned there's a lamppost. The lamppost might be my savior here. Yeah, that looks alright. Okay. Cool. Let's do a hard save because I can. Alright. Which way was I going? Uh, have I been that way? Yeah, that's where I just was. It's on top of. What direction is this? South west? This kicks in because we got too close to the uh, armors again, I guess. Where am I? Yeah, that's for sure. Uh, is that here? Are we down here? I don't know. It's a creepy looking place. Blue mushrooms, I think. Ah, uh, more sewer. That's not much use for anyone. A door. Doesn't open with those key. And the lockpicks just open with public works. Key. Does. Wait, is this another way to the thieves' spot? I mean, it feels like it should connect, right? Looks like the same kind of place. Uh, no, where are we now? Further west, have I been here? So my question throughout this map: Have I been here before? Uh, I don't think so. Can't get up there. Well, I can if I go this way. Whoa! Gave me a fright, sir. Your footsteps suddenly arrived from nowhere. Too. Anything in the toilets? Just muck. Cheese. Oh, bottle, I thought it was a mutter. Locked needs a key. Look, do I have a key? I doubt it, right? I wonder if the thieves key is the one that's gonna unlock uh Tim's place. Cause uh think that I can just get away with putting me around. I'll show them some of the Why does it sound like you're in my head? It's not disconcerting. Maybe he's up there. Here's Mr. Suddenly appearing footsteps. A few bugs of the sound propagation here, I guess. behind him while he was still not fully 100% alert, so 
second knockout attempt actually worked, but that was uh, a fluke more than anything else. There we go. No, no, one a dozen times. No, it actually is a Glaive Gizarm, you boffin. Oris himself told me so. And if someone knows his pole arms, it's him. Now pay up. When the shift's over, we're going out to arrest a few tankets. I mean, I'm sure you're right. Nice fancy swords. A bit too fancy for a guard. This is a training dummy, isn't it? Oh, this is the guy I was hearing before. Yeah, he, he must be up in there. What's there? Oh, there he is. There's nothing here. Nothing. No will. Guess I'm just nothing. Seems peaceful enough now. <coughs> oh guards. What are they watching? Are they guarding anything at Not all? Again. <gasps> Or they're just like standing. What can you even see from here? You see the statue. Make sure nobody runs off with the statue. Unexpectedly. <coughs> Alright, the statue is safe. I'm not gonna steal it. It's too heavy for me. But well, whatever you're keeping in this chest is not safe. I'll take that. 1171. We're uh, 1800 is our goal. Uh, 2400 if we're playing an expert, but 1800 because I only picked half. And um, we're getting there slowly. <sighs> See, nobody's going to take your fine statue. Alright. There's a key here I couldn't, a uh, uh, door here I couldn't unlock, right? This guy didn't have a key, did he? So nobody had a key for that door? In there? What is in here? This one. Apparently not. So... No, we can just go back north past the statue. So yeah, there is there, there's a key missing, that's right. Oh. Wait, that's where it came from. That's the public works place. Right. God, where am I? I keep getting lost. I've been here before. I've opened this door. This is where I started. Isn't it? Maybe are we here? Oh, I don't know. I don't know anything anymore. Let's just go back through here. At least then I kind of had an idea where I was going. But only vaguely. Oh, all this talking is making my throat very dry, so I have to stop drinking tea. Well, warning. Creepy cream in blue. Alright, so I haven't been up here, I don't think. But there may not be anywhere to go in particular. I was locked the gate. I'm leaning into a garden and I can unlock the gate. So there is somewhere to go. More moss! I won't say no, and another diamond. I certainly won't say no to that. Well, nice little garden you have here. You can't keep anything up here, do you? I don't climb on these gates. Yeah. Nothing, nothing hiding up here, alright. Just leave it open just to remind myself if I forget what it looks like that I've been there before. Because Garrett's the only one that leaves doors open everywhere. God, where am I going? Right, we're kind of heading back north. I guess we're trying to get um, trying to get to the Hammerites place. All right, here's the uh, magical jumping of doom. So north and east, I think. 
I hope. Oh dear me. Wait, oh, that's, that, that's that odd nook. Oh wait, it's north and east. Have I been down this way? Do I know where this goes? Yeah, I have. I came past this way. That's right, that's that place I climbed up. Alright, north and east. So here's what the climbed up there before where I thought was going to be the Hammer Chapel. Am I here now? Is, is this the way to the Hammers? Almost like the map bears no resemblance to the actual streets. Alright, we are at the armor, is it? Tomlinson's. He is to the north of us. So maybe this little street doesn't connect behind to the hammers. Maybe we have to come up this way. I don't know, I don't know. We'll find them. We'll find them. We just may not find the safest way in. Alright, so I haven't been to the south here, but it's a big gate that's closed because, by order of Warden Webster, Beggar's taking the lower lock to close for the night. Anyone attempting to trespass will receive ten strikes of the lash. Okay. That's definitely a new area. What's that in the window? What's that loot? Someone's stacking coins in the window. There's no guards around to watch me take it, I will try taking it. Of course. Strange place to keep your own money. Alright, so we've got path leading north and path leading south. South goes to Gloom Court, I guess. Or maybe Almskit. Or maybe just machinery. Oh, wait. I say, is there a canal we can go, go in? I mean, go in, but we can't actually get anywhere. What's up here then? Seamus A. Blatt, solicitor. Not much to go that way. Long way down that way. Hammer benches. Hammer hums. Can I hear any footsteps of people though? <laughs> that place. Why is that wood? Doesn't look like wood, so I don't think I can get there from here. This yes, will be the Hammerite Seminary. Give, give generously for the builder's plan. Wow. Well, you know, I'd love to, but uh, I'd, much more, I'd much rather break in and steal all you got. However, I don't really see a way in from this side. Oh yeah, I'm yawning, yawning all the time. How do I get down there? Oh, there's the balcony. There's the balcony. The guy, the guy we're trying to get to, the Shira guy. So we're almost at our uh, primary mission objective. If we can just find the way back down. That's not necessarily guaranteed. Yeah, we're not that way. Alright, back around. Oh, that's right, we have the north path and the south path. So that's, that was the north path, which kind of doesn't... That's weird, that didn't actually take me to anything at all, unless I'm blind as a bat. There was not nothing up there, not even like one P of loot. Well. Maybe it's back way into the hemorrhoids? I don't know. Downlock Seminary. And if I just creep up this way to take a look. Oh, 
going to say. Oh, he was going to say. We've got our friend's, or rather our target's house. We got it. On that side, but somebody neglected to lock this out. Also, this is another public works place. Kind of looks it. Where's my keys? No. No. Oh, it's a thieves place. Opens a thieves with the thieves key. Healing potion! Oh, nom nom. A hammer. Candlestick. Holy water. Why do I need holy water? Gold symbols. Are these the guys that hit the hammer out then? Ah, this is the guy who sent the letter to the guy down in the sewers. Saying, don't stay down there. Uh, where's that hammer? It's just sitting in the middle there. It's a magic hammer. Ooh. And the passage continues. Huh. Alright, I can just see some boxes and a vine and I don't know where it is and I don't know why. That's an important view. Alrighty. I'm just remembering something. I'm remembering up at Tim's house, there was another locked door. So... I'll make a note to go there afterwards, I think. Once we're done. Objectives need us to go out of downlock. Which is probably going to be the high... High gate? Gate? High town gate that we found earlier. The high town gate. Yeah, that's that too. Can't climb it. Can't climb that. I wonder if I need to. If there's any purpose. What's this? Alright. Somebody leaving a cup lying on their windowsill. These people in this town are very careless. I think it's all a bit of me. Look at this. Convenient. There's a wooden beam right by the balcony that I need to get in at. Let's try and jump in the mantle. That way it's quieter. Normal jump. Keep, keep an ear out for guards. I don't know what to expect here. He's got lots of guards outside, so he might well have lots of guards inside. He's also got banners. Death. Death to banners. Oh, it doesn't cut. Shame. Just textured them. He's got a room with a very odd ceiling here. It's half, half stars and half just wood. Knocked over candlestick. Something's something's up. Something is weird. Paintings. I, what am I even here for? Uh, to find Tim's letter of debt. And we still need 1800 loot, and we're on 1500, so we're getting there. Find another room. A banner that can't be cut. I mean, I've got got an argument with this fellow. door that's been improperly room brushed so you can't hear it from one side I'm surprised how common that is because it seems pretty straightforward to do it right but, uh, I guess if you just use the auto room brush hotkeys it won't do it for you so people don't then adjust their room brushes to be outside the door hmm Something is definitely missed there. More stuff scattered on the floor. Before I go that way, I'm going to check the other door. This door here. Oh, and also, let's take that. Oh, well, I can't unlock this one. Don't suppose any of the keys I have are likely to work. No. Oh, let's not throw a mine at my own feet. That would be 
I'll look the bullish. Okay. He's got very wobbly kind of ceilings here, don't they? Hmm. Alright. What have I got down here? He looks dead. As blood, as a bell. You have deep debts, my friend, and tonight you shall pay them in full. You should never have crushed me in our dealings, remember that? How does it feel now to stand in this study awaiting death? Uh, a double cross, Tim sold you out, but to who? Search his house on Dog's Run for evidence, deal with him any way you like. Uh, I hear some people coming in, so I better be uh, on my best behaviour. Hey, get up! Oh, help! Oh. I think we need you running for more guards. <laughs> Alright, so Tim's. Maybe that's the fancy sword Tim's had. Tim's already. Um, that's not coming from me, is it? That would be ridiculous. Oh, somebody already slashed the banner for me. But, user is key, right? That should open the other door that we had. Which might even be this door, you know? That leads out to guards. It's noisy too. Any secrets in his uh, bookcases? Or anything on top of them? Doesn't look like it. He's got Lord Baffert's throne. I guess Lord Baffert owed him too much money, and he uh, had to pay back some of the, some of his debt with that. All right, what have we got down here? This will be ground floor, I guess. We just lead out to where all the rest of the guards were. Always checking the stairs. Let's canal to the north. This door's very bright. Let's just explore the hallway first. Wow, this place goes all over. Ooh! Look at this loot. Loot storage. And it's not that key. It's a different key needed. Alright. So. We're Footsteps. Uh, there's got to be valuables in there, right? I don't know, but uh, the one thing we could reach through the window is it had nothing. I might be hearing the guards outside, I don't know. What about this key? Well, what happened to the key? What about this door? Nope. It is definitely locked, right? This is definitely locked too, right? Yeah. Alright, I bet they're both in the same room. Alright. There's the key again. Alright, what's dark? Right through here. It's a noisy floor. Gate with a lever to open it. Another different key needed. Any idea? Right, a guard I probably don't want to tangle with. I think there's another way I could have gone. So let's try looking at the other way I think I could have gone. Which was this door? Well, possibly that door. Also the door at the back near where I came in. Oh, we're above that room. Yeah. I know it's here. All right, what's this? Another key? Just because I've been here. Just the same. Just get away with 
I mean, to me, these look like candles, not like stacks of coins. Something like a different day, sir. All right. So hiding on. That's my key again. <coughs> oh, this is where I came in. I see they set a guard through here to try and catch me. Nice work on the double cross guys. This guard appears to be stuck. Guard. It's not, it's just a fellow. I wonder. I try carrot acrobatics on him. Oh! Oh! A mistake. I'm staying up here. We'll find you soon enough. So I mentioned it's a good place for hiding. I mean, it kind of is, but I should have put the rope over here first. Keep your eyes open. I have to wait for the guys to There's come down. Where do we have here? Which way does this take us? This takes us out west. Ah, uh, there's the archer. You know what? I was going to say it'd be a good. Oh, you saw me. There's another archer up there. Ah, oh, damn it. They're all too alert. Is there a sword down there? Maybe it was a guard. I thought it was just a... A harmless fellow. Well, I lost a little bit too much uh, health there. Get my rip arrow back, too. I, I think so. Everybody's still searching for me, but uh, they're, all, they're all downstairs, I think. So let's see what's through here. Explodey barrel of joy. Oh dear. You saw me. God, uh, he probably would have caught me if I hadn't been very lucky. Would anybody like some exploding barrels? Don't worry, I'll find you. Come out. All right, so we've got a lot of guards up there. If we want to go the short way back to Tim's place, but I kind of feel like that's what I need to do. However, it's been an hour and twenty minutes. So I'm going to end this episode right here. And I will see you here for the next episode. Thanks for watching. Come on out then.